Fellas, it's finally here, the Nintendo Direct. We haven't got one of these bad boys in over a year. Last year's E3, Nintendo showed us like really bad graphics of John Cena, and that was it. So I'm thinking Nintendo is really about to go crazy on this one. I mean, they, they we've been waiting a long time for this. I'm thinking right out the gate, Breath of the Wild 2. It's gonna be amazing. It's really gonna lean on a bunch of new creative types of traversal. Like, Link will be able to shoot himself out of a slingshot and, like, fly around and he's gonna have rocket boots to boost him up cliffs and shit. And then it's gonna be, like, boom, coming out in March. Pyra! Sorry, Rex. I couldn't tell you. Because... I got an invitation to join Snap! Fuck off! Oh my god! No! No! <laughs> Nintendo, why are you putting in the fucking boob job lady from the Furby sex game? Not only did you put another anime character with a sword, you put an anime character that is a sword. That is from a Furby sex slave game where you catch strippers like Pokemon. You could've put Crash Bandicoot. You could've put Gex, Rayman. You could've had Knack. You could've had Blinks. Glover, Funky Kong, you could have put middle-aged man from Sonic 06. Literally any other character would have been better than this. I would rather have Don Corneo's bodyguard than this. Please look forward to seeing their moveset in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. No. This fighter releases in March. Okay, see, they're, they're just fucking with us, you guys. They're just, they're just trolling us. Because think about it. What else comes out in March? That new Zelda. You know what I'm saying? They're showing us this abomination. And now here comes Zelda. Here we go. The vast world of Fadiel beckons. Okay, this is a JRPG from the Super Nintendo. Legend of Mana. Okay, okay, recover, recover. Everybody recover. Watch this. Retro Studio logo is going to pop up. Bow. Donkey Kong 3D Island. It's a Donkey Kong 3D platformer that Retro Studios has been working on for the past seven years, and it's going to look insanely good. Here it is. Hi, everyone. My name is Barbara Gordon. AKA Batgirl. Pikmin 4. Here it is. Pikmin 4. Come on. Metopia. Coming to Nintendo Switch. This is not Pikmin 4. This is. Uh, Whoa. Whoa. You can have a horse as an ally? That sounds pretty barn good. <sighs> Mario Odyssey 2. That's the only way they can redeem themselves at this point. Golf. This kind of looks funny, though. I'll play this. Last week. We had the global launch for the Super Mario 3D World plus Bowser's Fury game. Next, we have another game to show you. Here it is. Mario Odyssey 2. Here we go. Here we go. This is kind of a... Kind of a weird trailer for... Mario? Oh, oh, even better! Octopath Traveler 2! This is exactly what I wanted to see. The fuck? How was that? Extremely bad. And in the future, we'll conduct a survey to gather player feedback. We look forward to hearing your responses on the demo. This kind of confirms my theory that these JRPGs are no longer being developed by humans. It's just, I think they're taking a, sur they're surveying like 10,000 anime fans. They're asking them, what do you like about RPGs? What do you like about anime? And they're, they're feeding that information into a computer and the computer shoots out a game called Project Triangle Strategy, a brand new tactical RPG. It's getting desperate out here, you guys. <laughs> I think this is our only chance at this point. Reggie appears. He goes, I'm back at the company after my GameStop trick. Now watch this new trailer for Metroid Prime 4. It's gonna be very moody and atmospheric. And then a little twist, pow! Super Metroid is being remade by the guys that did Samus Returns, which is also being released onto the Switch today. From the creators of the Danganronpa, Donkey Konga, and Zero Escape series comes a fight for your life, literally. It's another RPG? Really? The game is canceled! Yeah! The game is suddenly called off. Yeah! Here we go. Now you're talking my language. Now watch this. It's gonna go. Mario Kart. No. Bravely Default 2 is almost here. I give up. Four Heroes of Light will soon embark on a journey to restore the crystals. Computer, don't you think that title is a little bit on the nose? Like you're literally calling it Bravely Default 2. Like, is, is there no shame in this world anymore? 
Now show F0. What the fuck? I see what they're doing. It's it's an anime theme. They're doing an anime theme. The next game is going to be Bayonetta 3. Now that's something that I can play, okay? Here we go. Show me Bayonetta 3. Eight protagonists. Eight captivating journeys. Isn't that... Is, isn't that the Saga Frontier has been remastered for Nintendo Switch with the addition of the playable protagonist Fuse. Oh, Fuse is in this. Oh, finally, some good news. Okay, we don't. Yeah, it canceled the Mario. How's it going so far? Fuck you. There's still a little bit more to show you in today's Nintendo Direct. Mario. Zelda, Zelda. Hello there. I'm Eiji Aonuma, producer of the Legend of Zelda series. Here we go. I'm sure a lot of you saw me and thought there might be news about the sequel to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild game. Unfortunately, we don't have anything to share right now. We apologize.